Hey, remember me, the Pets.com spokes puppet? <laughs> yeah, I know you haven't seen me in like a decade since the dot-com bubble burst, <laughs> but I'm back. Hey, and I hear there's this new online pet supply place making a lot of noise, gonna succeed where Pets.com failed. Well, I'm here to tell you, you're wrong. They say they have a better business model than Pets.com did, but a high percentage of uh, auto recurring subscription sales, that won't keep you afloat. Huge volume-based discounts from FedEx won't save you. It's all about brand loyalty. And brand loyalty comes from a warm, fuzzy place, like having a doggy spokes puppet. What makes PetFlow think they can do this without me? I'm in my prime. I'm in great shape to be a spokes puppet again. I've been a Macy's balloon, man. I was on the Super Bowl. Oh, I know what you're thinking. I'm a has-been. My time is coming gone. Okay, so Pets.com went under, but, but it was ahead of its time. Man, I was ahead of my time. What, what do you want me to do, huh? Beg? Well, you want to see the doggy beg? Okay, okay, I'll beg, man. I'll sit up. I'll bark. I'll speak. Roof. I'll roll over. I'll do anything, man. Please, give me a chance. Come on. I haven't had a steady job since 2000. I've got child support payments to make. Please, you need me. I'm a good doggy, a good doggy, I am. Oh, well, I'm sorry. Oh, here's my girlfriend. Uh, I gotta go. Come on, lamb chop. You got the lint brush? Let's party.